Here's a noon update for December 18, 2012. On the S&P three-month chart, looks like we have uh, wave wave one, flat wave two, into wave three, and uh, or expand flat. And um, a wave three breakout occurred this morning, and um, it was around 14:38. And we broke that. If this turns to one, two, three, high target to have would be about 15:30 and a full upward three, and that would be um, off of a wave two uh, flat pattern. And um, that would be 1.68 times wave one. For the Dow, this could be, um, actually when I look at this, it looks kind of like a very shallow two here. It could be one, two, three, four, five, into a shallow two, into a three. Highest target would be if this is one, two, three, it would be as high as, a, I believe, um, let's see, 14,500 approximately, one, two, three. Uh, for NASDAQ, has a more clearly defined pattern. It looks like wave, wave one, flat wave two into a third wave. We took out the top of the wave one around uh, 30, 33, and we're setting up for a third wave. Highest target of this is one, two, three, and the flat would be as high as um, 160, about 3,200 if this is one, two, three. Current position I have right now is TQQQ, which I bought at 5368, and now it's 5392 on about 20, I think it was uh, 2,500 shares. I don't remember. Big position. Um, Upro, I have uh, 2,000 shares of. I paid, uh, paid uh, 88.26, and now it's 90.83. Intraday highs were on 91.31, so it was up about three points at the highs. Uh, but anyway, uh, looks like all three indices are entering in third waves, like big third waves. So I'm going to be trading it up as usual. And um, I actually made um, 10 profitable trades in a row in the past month, so. Even paying attention, that's 10 in a row. <laughs> that's a wrap.